Hi, everyone. I recently got five baby chicks, so I thought it would be fun to draw chickens. Today, we will need paper, a black marker, crayons, or colored pencils. That's all you're going to need. Okay, let's get started. Okay, so today we are drawing the chicken, and this chicken is going to be on a nest in its barnyard. So um, I want you to gather up some materials that you're going to be using, your paper, your crayons, a black marker, and if you want, instead of going directly to the marker, you can start out with a pencil. And if you use the pencil, you'll need an eraser. I'm going to be just starting with the marker, and that's really because it's easier for you to see it in the camera. If I use a pencil, it's really hard to see. So we're gonna be starting by drawing the body of the chicken. And this chicken is going to be taking up most of the paper, so he's, he, she is rather large. And your first line is going to be a swoop up. So you're going to be making a line that goes up like that. And then you're gonna start coming down. And this is going to be the front part of her body right here. And then you're just gonna bring your pencil or your pen and come all the way up and meet her tail. So that's her tail. And this is going to be her face right here. So now we'll go ahead and put her eye on. We'll give her eye a nice big round eye. It's gonna be like this, really big. And then there's going to be an iris in there. We can make an oval iris. It's sort of close on one side to the big circle. And I'm gonna go ahead and color this in black. And if you're using a pencil, you can just go ahead and leave it open without any coloring in it. And then when you go back and um, go over all your pencil lines with the black marker, you can color it in. Okay, now we're gonna give her a beak. And you wanna do a diagonal line down and then a diagonal line that comes up to meet that. And then there's going to be a center line and I want you to put this center line more towards the bottom, closer to this line than to that line. So not directly in the middle, but like, like that. And that's just showing that this top of her beak is larger than the bottom of her beak. Okay, and chickens have this extra little bit of skin right here that's right there. So we're just gonna do like an oval underneath her beak. And then chickens have this really cute little crown on top of their heads. And you're just going to be making some lines that go like that, almost like a flower, right on the top of her head. And then chickens are all different colors, so you can color your chicken any, any color you want. But to give it some definition, we're going to be separating the top part of her color from the bottom part of her color. So if you can make a series of lines that go like this, almost like a zigzag. So that was just like, like that, like drawing a mountain almost. And then we're gonna give her a tail. And the tail is drawn just like this little crown here. Make it a little larger so you can do some lines like that for her tail. And then she needs a wing. So we're going to give her a big wing that goes like this. Sort of like a big teardrop. And then we'll just add a couple lines in here just to represent feathers, okay? And then this chicken, she is gonna be sitting on a nest and she's probably got some eggs in there. So you can just draw some curvy lines that will represent her nest. And she's sitting in a barnyard, so Behind her, there's going to be a little meadow, and we can just make a little a little meadow look that goes kind of swoopy, and then don't go over her body. Come and finish the line over there. And then I think it would be nice to put a couple flowers in her, her yard so she has something pretty to look at. So we'll put two flowers over here. 
just draw some like daisy type of flowers or any kind of flowers that you like to draw and the stems and maybe some leaves and maybe we'll put a flower over here too one flower maybe over behind her and then let's put a sun in the sky she's out in the sun and you draw a nice bunch of lines like that just a fun looking sun you could also draw a round sun or you could even leave a sun off you could just you could do some white puffy clouds if you want but there we're all done and there she is so let me show you one that I've colored One that I've colored and you'll see that I colored the sky blue and the sun yellow and I put some yellow coloring inside with the blue to give it some more color so it's not all blue and I left some some of the blue I didn't some of the sky I didn't color blue I left it white and I made her yellow orange and red and I made the flowers pink and she's in a behind on a there's a green meadow behind her and she's just sitting there probably sitting on some eggs and just a happy chicken so i hope you had fun doing her that was fun